He may have been able to keep his low-cost promise, but Tony Fernandez, the flamboyant CEO of Malaysian low-cost carrier AirAsia, is having a tough time in India. His plans to make Chennai the base for AirAsia's Indian operations have come unstuck, and the airline is now forced to make Bengaluru its new home. The airline has already moved the bulk of its ground staff to the IT city, although it has retained the maintenance and repair unit in Chennai for the time being. Sources say AirAsia wanted to use the old domestic terminal in Chennai and had sought more parking slots. But the Airports Authority of India has been sitting on this request from long. Aviation experts say for AirAsia, Bengaluru will be a better option as it will offer it better facilities and help cut the turnaround time. And they're going to add more aircrafts and when they add more aircrafts, they'll... Uh make uh, one or two airports their bases. Maybe they have got a better, good offer from uh, Bangalore International Airport uh, to shift base. That is what private sector uh, operators do, that you know, they compete uh, against uh, other airports. AirAsia, right from the beginning, has maintained that it will make Chennai as its operational hub. But now by shifting to Bangalore, it will push up the operating cost significantly. And it's also a sign of how private airport players are warming up uh, to the welcome for the new Indian carriers. And Tony Fernandez is also learning to do business the Indian way. Utkarsh Chaturvedi, ET Now, Mumbai.